a live orchestra will give us a sound that is impossible to get on a computer. Uh, a live orchestra is three-dimensional. It has depth, warmth, feeling. And if I've done the right job, and if the, my, my layer on the cake is what it's supposed to be, I'll get chills up my arms when I hear my music being recorded by this 35-piece orchestra. That's music as an art. Hi, my name is Alf Clausen, and I'm a composer. Yeah, Dell, we need one more. We had uh, too much cowbell in the beginning and not enough in the end. <laughs> cowbell is very important here, you know. <laughs> in pursuing my dream of um, arranging, composing, conducting, etc., I also had to do something to support the family, and playing uh, as a playing musician was a good solution to that. So I worked a lot as a playing bass player, playing French horn player. It's the kind of experience that one can't learn at school. The Simpsons uh, job fell into my lap totally unexpectedly. I had just finished the Moonlighting series on the ALF series for four years, and they were both ended, and I was out of work for seven months. So I called a friend of mine, um, and I said, well, if you hear of anything going on, please let me know. So he called me a couple of weeks later and he said I was just having dinner with my nephew last night and he told me that he was a producer on a television show and they were looking to change composers. He said, well, have you ever done an animated show before? I said, no. He said, do you want to do an animated show? I said, no. And I was basically looking upon myself as being a drama composer and that's what I do, wanted to do with my life. He says, why don't you come in for the interview and we'll talk about it and I'll have you meet Matt Groening and the producers, etc." I said, okay, so I'll take the meeting. And Matt welcomed me and shook my hand and he said, um, would you be interested in doing, uh, being a composer on an animated series? And I said, no. I gave him the same uh, song and dance about my plans, and he said, well, we don't look upon our show as being a cartoon, but we look upon it as being a drama where the characters are drawn, and we'd like to have it scored that way. Could you do that? So I said, well, uh, that's very interesting. I think I could do that. Uh, that's what I specialize in. I said, uh, why don't you give me an episode and we'll see how it goes. I thought that they would probably throw me out on my ear when I told them that I wanted to do a double recording session and it's gonna cost them a lot of money. But I told them and they said, whatever you want. And they gave me my first episode and I scored it and they liked it and they kept me. I do sing on The Simpsons a lot. I really have a ball. I love group vocals. I love group singing, so I really enjoy it. The day of recording is much fun for me. That's when everything comes together. Uh, I usually have a 35-piece orchestra. Matt Groening, the creator of the show, is basically the one who has requested the orchestral sound for the show. And he feels that acoustic music smooths out the animation. The musicians come in, they uh, take out their instruments, warm up. And we start recording at 2 o'clock, and uh, the musicians have never seen any of this music before. This is all brand new. Uh, they are an unbelievably talented group of people. We'll end up doing rehearsals maybe two times, three times, four times at most. Uh, we'll do two or three takes, and we've got it, and we move on to the next music cue. So we just do them one at a time, one at a time, knock them off, knock them off. We get to five o'clock and we've recorded all of the music for that session. Uh, it's just a phenomenal process. It's so much fun for me to um, hear my music come alive and to listen to the senses of humor that uh, not only the musicians have, but my team has in the booth. We, we're here to have a good time in addition to making some really good music. So we enjoy being together and doing that. Good for me. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Hi, I'm Tabitha Dumo. And I'm Napoleon Dumo. Otherwise known as Nappy Tabs. 